The need for blood is reaching critical levels in hospitals in North Texas now say the, sh the shortage may delay emergency medical procedures. Nicole Nielsen explains how doctors and their patients are feeling the impact. It's a huge crisis. The need for blood is always apparent, but now it's critical. Without human beings, without volunteers willing to donate to save their fellow man and woman, we're, you know, we have no blood. On Monday, the American Red Cross announced they were experiencing an emergency blood shortage as the nation faces the lowest number of people giving blood in 20 years. Over the, the last three to four years, we've actually seen a decrease in almost 300,000 donors. And it's no better in North Texas. Here at Medical City North Hills, they say it could be hours, even up to a day before a patient in need gets blood. I would say it's very dangerous. We can do things to try to, you know, give them fluids, things to try to hold until we can get the blood. Dr. Curtis Johnson says donations have continuously slowed since COVID, but even more so the last few months during the holidays. Hospitals around North Texas are in need of all types of blood. The Red Cross shared with me these images from their North Texas dash. These fridges should be full. We're not able to fill every hospital's request for blood. We just don't have enough to put it at every hospital. They worry more challenges could lie ahead as seasonal illnesses compound with the emergency shortage and say anyone who can should step up to save a life. This is truly an opportunity when you volunteer to donate blood that you can truly be a hero. You save lives. In North Richland Hills, Nicole Nielsen, CBS News, Texas. January is National Blood Donation Month, and CBS News Texas is proudly partnering with the American Red Cross to roll up our sleeves and do our part. And we invite you to join us. Come out to AT&T Stadium's parking lot next Friday, January 19th, to scan that QR code on your screen to register for a time. We'll be out there from 11 a.m. to 5.30 p.m.